Welcome back, Odoers. Isn't IoT fun? And who's ready for more of that fun? Now, with Odoo's IoT box, we can connect tons of different devices to our database, ranging from label printers, cameras, scales, payment terminals, even measuring devices, and as you saw, my foot pedal as well. Now, it's another day here at Stealthywood, and we just got a new printer over here. Now, I could set it up as is, but we don't do that. That's very boring, and I'd have to download every document I need to print onto my computer. And then I'd have to send it to that printer. Or, I could connect this printer with Odoo IoT, and together they'd be direct, and that would make printing easy as a breeze. Now, Odoo will remember the device for me, and I could even link the printer to a specific operation such as work orders, delivery labels, or even receipts as well. Now, enough chit chat. I'm excited and this thing is heavy. Let's hop into and see how everything works with Odoo IoT. All right, Odooers, connecting a printer is easy. Now we really just need to connect the USB of the printer to the IoT box. Now up next, we'll need to reboot the device so that the USB printer is recognized. In our case, I can actually just do it manually by unplugging the IoT device but it can also be completed from the IoT Box admin console inside of the Odoo database. Now, we'll wait for this to reboot. Perfect. IoT will recognize the device in just a few short seconds. Now, this is true for any device. Now, when I click into the IoT Box, I can see a list of devices that are connected to the IoT Box as well. We can see the printer I've installed here over there, and it's beautiful. And when I go into the devices from the IoT module, we could see the printer again that we just installed. It has a green connected label on it. Now I'm going to click into it just so that I could show you something. And we can see here that there are different printer reports we can attach this printer to and that we can access via the print action menu. In our case, if we select to add a line, printing, any of these, boom, created. Now, we can also even see something very particular, and that is the different options available to create the report. Now, I'm going to set ours to product label. Now, I want you to keep in mind one more thing, and that is that the printer can also be configured via Odoo POS, for my acronym lovers, which stands for point of sale, and inside of the manufacturing app as well, Odooers. Now, this is the exact same process that we'll use to connect many other devices to your IoT box. For more information on connecting specific devices, be sure to check out our documentation. Now, connecting a device is as simple as plug and play with the Odoo IoT box. As you saw, I literally connected this bad boy up since all the drivers are literally housed within the framework of IoT. So don't be afraid to go on in and explore. Now that's it for this tutorial. Now be sure to stay tuned for other specific tutorials dealing with connecting devices or with IoT box or any of my other fun ones. Now, thank you for watching, everyone. I'll see you next time.